Hello, this is Josephine Gibbs here. You're watching a video of mine to find out how to use PixelR in doing a composite, uh, creating an alien from whatever planet you want, uh, using two pictures of Earth animals. And this is how you do it. Please don't forget to subscribe if you already no, if you have you already to uh, subscribe. Thank you very much for continuing to watch my videos. Hello, you're watching a video in how to use PixelR in creating a composite animal and turn it into an alien animal from the planet Pandora. So what you're going to do is you are going to find PixelR. So create a new tab here and then type in PIXLR. Then you have pixelr.com editor. Yes, select that one. Suggestion from uh, Google. Now we'll end up with this page and go to editor. Okay, so if you already have selected it before and use the free version, uh, the trial, you click on image, open image. Okay, open image because uh, you need two animals. You need whatever one you want. I've chosen a kangaroo, so I've chosen my kangaroo, which I screenshot earlier, and I'm going to use an ant, which I'll tell you a little bit more. Now, the idea is to make sure that this layer, the kangaroo picture layer, is renamed. So I'm going to rename it the kangaroo layer. Okay, so you double click on the actual name of the actual layer. Next, we are going to go to the layer tab here and you select open images layer. I have screenshot a picture of an ant against a white background. Open that one. So what happened here now is we have two layers, okay, the kangaroo layer and the layer one. You also rename that one ant layer, so you know which one you're on. Uh, so that's a good idea to make sure you selected it so it's blue rather than this one, it's just not selected. Okay, so the next thing is we are going to use our eraser to delete some sections of the ants because we're going to combine the ant and the kangaroo together. So we're going to erase it. So this is where I got this is the eraser tool. Yeah, so I'm going to go back to my kangaroo and get rid of the, the body of the ant and just keep the kangaroo layer instead so it has a, a kangaroo body then the, the ant will have a kangaroo body at this moment um, it is slightly unrealistic because the ant is too small so what we're going to do is we are going to expand the, kang the ant layer to make it slightly bigger so what you do is you need to make sure you are selecting the ant layer and go to edit tab and you select free transform and that makes gives you a uh, the handles to expand that layer all right so here we might be able to grab and follow that line here Again, we are going to go get out of there. So you make sure you yes say yes. Do you want to apply the changes? So yes. And I'm going to go back to my ant layer and make sure I will then use my eraser to reclaim some of the shapes of the kangaroo. Yeah, that's slightly better than before. And it's much more realistic. And here we have a picture of a kangant, if you want to call it kangant. And then we're going to go to file, we're going to save the image, and save. And of course, we're going to make up a name. It's a combination of kangaroo and ant, so it'd be a kangant, but we do a little bit some extra by making it sound like a genus. A Latin genus of a, an animal, so Kangaturus pandorum. So this is supposed to be a, an alien creature from the planet Pandora. 
and make sure you select a, a good quality picture like from PDF. So often it comes up as B, BMP or TIFF, PNG, JPEG. For the moment, we'll use JPEG and press OK. And it goes into your pictures. Save that. OK. And that's how it is. You have created a composite animal using um, XLR. Please don't forget to share this video or um, subscribe to my channel.